Arun, uh, I want you to explain for a minute why Google is an ad holding company. And then we're going to take a uh, survey of the panel. Okay, so if you look at Google's approach, in many respects, I think I definitely feel jealous about the way they've approached it because as a sell side player, they've done a lot of things which as a buy side player, we as an industry should have done. So if you look at the way they revolutionized the way search was bought, it was their technology. It's basically the sell side that's driven it. But if you look at the way they look at their products and then they look at the, you look at the way they've structured it and you look at the way they make it bare in terms of advertising, there are a lot of similarities there. Now, obviously, they have a lot more product and technology than any of us do, which is fine, which is a distinction. But in a lot of the way they approach, and the, more, the bigger and bigger that they've gotten, in fact, they've started to mimic that behavior a lot more. And I just feel like there's a lot to learn from them as well, because they have actually revolutionized the buy side, whereas they are largely a sell side player. Everything they do is to monetize advertising. Okay, so let's survey the panel, yes or no. Uh, Josh, is, is Google an ad holding company? Yes or no? <laughs> Can I have two words? Two words. So I actually, I think they're more complex than that. I think they have media platforms, and like sorry, I'm gonna oh channel God. the Havas guy from last year and go way over my time, <laughs> I apologize. They have media products and they have skills products, and we tend to buy more of their skill-based products from them and use them to build our own capabilities. To us, they are definitely a technology vendor, not a media vendor. Okay, Stefan. I agree, I agree. No, no, they're not an ad holding. They're not an ad holding. All right. 